Hey gorgeous. So my name's Amanda. You know, I was just surfing YouTube and I came across your giveaway video. And not only did it catch my eye because of the giveaway, but because you were asking for advice on something that I have had such a hard time with myself. Um, and I decided that instead of just leaving a comment that meant nothing, I would actually explain the product to you. So instead of you having to go and research it, I would just bring it here and show you. Um, you asked for a comment um, describing our favorite eyeliners and mascaras. Well, I have one eyeliner that I use on a daily basis. And I have four mascaras. Yes, four. You asked for one. I know. I love them all equally, I guess. But I'll be happy to explain each one to you, show you every brush, etc. So, since I only have one eyeliner, we'll go ahead and start out with that. Like I said, um, in my first comment, I'll also leave another comment with the products as well. Um, but my favorite, favorite, favorite eyeliner, I've been using this for, I think, about two years now, every single day, is the Maybelline New York Define Align, and it's an ebony black, and you just, it looks like this. Sorry, the quality's not too great, I'm on my webcam. Um, you just pull this off, and you just twist it like this, twist, twist, twist. It just looks like this. Well, I made it really big so you could see it, but. And it's really, really, really creamy. Like, there's a swatch of it. It's a lot blacker in person. Um, but they come in a very wide range of colors. Light, light black, dark black, light brown, dark brown, etc. It also comes with this, like, a little smudge stick. Or, like, a corrector. Sorry, mine's, like, gross. <laughs> There's a cleaner side right there. Um, but this is really good for, like, you know, just, like, put it under your eye. You could, like, smudge your eyeliner if you don't want it as dark. Um, I usually use it as, like, a corrector. If I smear some, I'll just kind of, you know, push it up into my eyeliner. That way it's not, like, running. Um, next is my mascaras. I love these. I love mascara. They do great things for you. Um, I don't wear false lashes at all. And my first and one, number one favorite is the Maybelline New York, the Falsies Volume Express, and it's flared mascara. It just looks like this. This one isn't the waterproof one. It stays on very, very well, though. I find the waterproof one is not needed. Um, I can go swimming, and this still stays on perfect. Um, this is what the brush looks like. It's kind of curved. I don't think you can really see it on camera. This mascara alone by itself will make you look like you are wearing false lashes. It really, really, really flares your lashes like it says it does. It wings them out perfectly. It's not clumpy at all. Period. This is number one go-to. Always have it with me always um then I have really short eyelashes so I don't really like to put that on the bottom because it kind of I'm not sure how to explain the way it makes it look it works but I prefer the telescopic explosion mascara in carbon black and this is by L'Oreal Paris and it's just this really 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 tiny brush and it's just a small little circle br circle brush um, I usually use this on like the corners, like right here, like this, and on the inside, and on the bottom, because it's such a small brush. It really grabs those little lashes and pulls them out. Um, next is this um, NYC Big Bold uh, Mascara. It's just a really thick brush like this. I really enjoy putting this over my falsies. It really makes them a little bit darker. Um, but this is a very good combination with the telescopic mascara on the bottom and the corners just to flare them out and to make sure I grab all those little hairs. This is a more pricier 
kind of splurging mascara, but it by itself works really well as well. This is the Extravagant Lashes by number 7. This looks like, oops, <laughs> just looks like that. And this is in the color black. You can see that. And like I said, this is a little more pricey, but this is very good on its own. Top lashes, bottom lashes. Um, I really like this one. I don't really like the smell. It's a really strong smell. But um, you can't smell it on your lashes, of course. So This is what the brush looks like. It's actually like a square brush. And the whole reason I bought this mascara was because the brush intrigued me. So, um, this is my second favorite. This I like to wear just by itself, like I said. And then, like I said earlier, the Falsies. The NYC Big Bowl Mascara over top. And then the L'Oreal Telescopic Explosion Mascara on the inside corners and the bottoms of my eyelids. Bottoms of my eyelashes. And it really helps grab those baby hairs and bring them out. Um, you're also other best 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 friend paired with your mascara is my elf eyelash curler I know you didn't care about this but I'm just sharing my you know um love for my eyelashes for you I mean eyelashes totally change the way you look you can have no makeup on just a mascara and you look amazing so but this is my elf eyelash curler it is the best one that I have ever had it's only like maybe five dollars on elf maybe three I'm not sure I bought it a while ago. So, this is your best friend paired with your mascara. Um, but like I said, I'll link all the products um, in a comment as well. But I just wanted to actually be a little bit different than everyone else and leave a video response. Something that you could actually see the product without having to go research it yourself. Um, and yeah, that's it. Thank you.